are now at the scene of the crime where a 20 year old man was violently killed. Police say there are now three suspects in custody, but they don't know who could have done it. I'm Detective Eric Andre. Detective Eric Andre. Hello? Where were you two nights ago? I was uh, in my room. What were you doing? I, I, I was watching TV. I need specifics if you're gonna get off the hook, pal. I was watching Love Island. But you're an adult man. I, I just can't get enough of the villa, you know? And you're gonna testify this in the court of law. No. I'm keeping my eye on you. Where were you two nights ago? Dan. I'm not saying nothing until I get a lawyer. I have a hunch that you were at the scene of the crime. You're not getting anything out of me, dig. What's the attitude, mister? You're cruising for a bruising. Why, Ayana? Mrs. Smith, is that right? Yes, indeed. Where were you two nights ago? Well, I was at home cooking me some chicken and grits. Mrs. Smith, are you aware that the boy that was murdered owed you $2,000? I let him have money so he could pursue his dreams of going to clown school. Uh -huh. Next thing I know, he spends it all on Dr. Pepper. That boy was addicted. He was in the clutches of the Dr. Pepper monster. Boy was gonna croak sooner or later. We found fingerprints on the weapon that you used to stab the boy. I've been framed. Framed, I say. This is unjust. I demand my lawyer. No way, Jose. You were too locked in, and now you're going to be locked in for good, in a cell that is. I swear I'm innocent, I didn't do nothing to that boy. It was me. I killed him for you, because I'm your son. Danny, my beautiful baby boy, together forever at last. You're both going away for a long time.